Hi guys, welcome back to Redbird Projects. So today we're going to do distressed high-waisted shorts. And I've got my old pair of denim that I got at Valley Village for six bucks. A bit big, but hopefully the dryer will shrink them a bit. And you want to make sure your first cut is going to be below the pockets by a lot. You don't want to go too short at the very beginning. So this is about roughly two inches below the pockets, maybe an inch and a half below the butt. So just make it extra long. And then you just snip it across. I just, what I do is, I, I do one leg and then I just trace it over onto the other side of the jeans. You could draw it out on both sides, whatever you like. So really rough cut, don't need to be precise. Okay, so here I'm going to fold it over and trace it and keep your excess material for anything else you can make. So here's, uh, I'm doing the second cut now. You want to be a little more precise, but cutting and the line itself, it can be pretty messy because you're going to be shredding and fraying the ends anyway. So I like the back to be longer than the front. And um, just, just, it's personal preference, but you guys do whatever you want, whatever you want. So I here, here I am now, cutting again. <laughs> I like having the sides to kind of come up curved. You can have it straight across. You can have it um, I don't know, deeper curve. Anything you like, really. Um, you want to make sure at the crotch it's the same length. That would be a bit weird if if one side's a bit longer there and then. Yeah, so you want to make sure that's quite accurate. So here I am just tracing it over. If you want to get out a ruler, by all means, get out a ruler. I'm kind of eyeballing everything, but yeah, so that's that. And then next is actual slits, I guess you'd say, distressed parts of the shorts. Um, so you cut a slit in the shorts, wherever you want it, make sure you do not cut your pocket, people. You do not want to cut your pocket. You don't want any valuable items falling out because of your silliness. <laughs> so you want to cut a little extra piece off too when you cut the slit so it's kind of like, I don't know, a little open spot. <laughs> so you guys are the designers. You can put as many slits in your shorts as you want. It's all up to you. You can put on the back, you can put on the front, you can put on the pockets, uh, the upper pockets, not your actual pockets. But um, yeah, so I think I ended up doing like three slits on one side, two on the other, and then a little bit on the pockets. And you'll see it anyway at the end. So this is now your tweezer part. If uh, your tweezers are damaged by this. I'm sorry. Um, I apologize in advance. My tweezers are fine. They're okay. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so you just rip the shorts. Like, you just go mad. Um, it's actually pretty painful for your thumbs. So if you have a friend around who's willing to do the other half of the shorts for you, then that's great. If not, then, um... I think you'll be okay. So, yeah. Don't worry if you don't think it looks fluffy enough because washing it and putting it in the dryer will uh, definitely make it look fluffy. <laughs> so here's the final look, guys. Thanks for watching.